So I noticed there's a lot of wasps. Around here, they're looking for water. I don't know, they're flying around somewhere right here. I see them right now, but I can't see them right now. Oh, there's one just passed, but see these ants? There's a bunch of ants all over the flowers. And they're looking for water and they're killing everything everyone has their AC on over there right here this AC everyone that house this house I'm sure that house has it on as well And if I was able to do what well, I can, um, pull up some, see there's a wasp right there. They're looking for water. So they're probably eating or taking the grass blades and I was gonna say like if I could do a Google search or Google overview of all the houses in California there's a bunch of them so that's not this is not only happening here it's happening everywhere so that's why I uploaded that video talking about we need to somehow get this water that these AC things are extracting from the atmosphere back into the atmosphere. Because, because at the end of the day, we're just defeating the purpose, I think, maybe. Or, or maybe it's not true. I don't know. But I mean, it kind of makes sense. But I mean, everything seems good as long as everything is watered. You know, things are going to be green. And all these trees, all these plants around, they're all getting water somehow from the sprinklers or whatever. Obviously, right? So. I guess if we don't want any famine, or like sickness, you know, sicknesses and diseases, then we gotta work together and come up with a solution somehow. There's spider webs everywhere. They're all looking for water and food. It's crazy. It's kind of sad. Maybe it's not anything for anyone to worry about because there's still water like in the Sacramento River, the ocean. And a bunch of other places. <laughs> but even so, a lot of the water has, um, like it's disappearing or evaporating into the atmosphere, you know, from the lakes and stuff like that, um, the dams. Like, I live here near Lake Shasta. 
I think if someone does a Google search, you know, you'll figure out that the water has gone down. And it's probably mainly because of the AC units and stuff. Probably. Because that the water in the lakes is probably trapped water, stagnant water. So it can't go anywhere. This water, when it goes down to the dirt, is going back into the lakes under the ground probably and going to the ocean. So that's happening everywhere. But that's just my, my theory, my hi hypothesis. And I mean, if it's true, then then we all got to work together to figure something out to come up with a solution to the existing problem so we could all be happy and and um, stuff like that. But I'm going to end this video. Thank you guys for listening. Have a great day. God bless.